BCS recommends that you check the oil in your tractor's transmission after every 50 working hours, with a full replacement after every 100 working hours. When the time comes for replacement, you will need the following tools. A funnel, an oil drain pan with a minimum 3 quart capacity, a 14 millimeter wrench or socket, either 80 weight 90 or 90 weight gear oil, silicone sealant, and possibly a fine bladed flat screwdriver. Plan to change the oil at the end of one of your work sessions. Simply running the engine is not sufficient since the wheels must be rotating in order to warm the gear oil. But by operating the tractor for a minimum of 15 to 20 minutes, the oil will be warm and therefore will drain more completely. Start by removing the dipstick, which is located on the top cover of the transmission on the engine side of the steering column base. If present, remove the blue cover. Because there is a rubber o-ring that creates a friction fit between your dipstick and the top cover, always remember to twist the dipstick before lifting it. If you are unable to twist it, simply slide a fine bladed flat screwdriver between the bottom of the dipstick cap and the top of the transmission housing, and pry the dipstick upward by twisting the blade to a vertical position. Check the dipstick to verify the oil is at or near the full mark. If the level is not within the operating range between the full and low marks, remember to check your dipstick more frequently in the future for a possible problem. To keep it from sticking the next time you need to remove it, rub a bit of gear oil on the o-ring before replacing the dipstick. Now, raise the attachment end of the tractor and block it so that the engine side of the tractor is tilting slightly downward. With the drain pan underneath the transmission, remove the drain plug with your 14 millimeter wrench or socket. After all of the oil has drained, put a small amount of silicone sealant on the threads of the plug. Thread it into the housing. and tighten completely. Return the tractor to a level position, namely one in which the base of the engine is parallel to the floor. Insert your funnel in the dipstick hole and add the approximate amount of oil needed for your model tractor. Do not add it all since you don't want the level to rise above the full mark on the dipstick. Take your time and add the remaining oil required to reach the full mark. Do not overfill. Reinsert the dipstick, replace the blue cover, and dispose of the waste oil in an environmentally responsible way. Make sure to recheck your transmission oil level after the next 50 working hours. In conclusion, please know that we welcome your feedback and questions. To contact us about the content of this video, please call 888-224-4271 or email info at bcsamerica.com. Thank you.